soft boiled eggs half cooked egg, right? It's like only three dollar fifty cents, which is really cheap for hawker center price. Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Today's vlog, uh, as you guys know, we're gonna let you to decide what we're gonna eat. So let me put the results for breakfast over here, which is a typical Singaporean breakfast. So yeah, let's go. <laughs> so this is the menu, and then you have different different sets for you to choose from. So for breakfast, we got a soft boy egg. A Milo, which is like hot chocolate, a hot tea, and kaya butter toast. So, pretty sure you guys have this egg here, but it's actually like uh, half cooked egg. Soft boy egg is half cooked egg, right? I thought soft boy egg is soft boy egg. <laughs> but it's half cooked, it's not fully cooked, right? Yeah. Is it cooked? Uh, I, I think it's cooked. That's why I don't eat it. <laughs> but it's nice. So, what? We usually put a sauce, it's like a dark soya sauce, and then some pepper. Yeah, inside the toast there is a butter and kaya jam. Actually, why, why like so little uh, the kaya jam? This one doesn't have any Yeah, thing. why is, why is it, it like this? Pathetic. Why <laughs> oh, cold? Yeah. The butter has to be cold. Yeah. It's a tea. Yeah. So what I usually do is I will drink drink the egg. It's nice. There's an egg smell. Ew. Nice. That's the later I have dragon bread. <laughs> Not about pimple here. Yeah, that was happy. But I put the I put the antibiotic cream then the next day gone. You didn't want a toast, I just realized. Yeah. There's only uh, one piece left, which is mine. I prefer the French toast. But you wanted to be traditional. French toast is very traditional. I, want, I, I wanted to be traditional to show you guys. That's how I got this instead. But I love the French toast. I had um, kaya toast in Korea before. Huh? It was very uphouse. We're done with breakfast and we're gonna take a break at our grandma's house before heading over to lunch. So lunch... I think it's hawker center food if I'm not wrong. But let me just check again. And yeah, see you guys for lunch. We are gonna buy lunch right now, and the winner for lunch is Hawker Center food. So we are walking over to our grandma's nearby Hawker Center to buy some food. We'll show you guys what we got later. Look at the cow, look at the rain. What the heck? It's raining super heavily. Ah! The rain is flashing in, you know. Five, six, seven, eight. $3.50, which is really cheap for Hawker Center price. I wish that I knew why. I think it's been about six months. Did you forget about our plans to see each other soon? Cause I was fine now just to see. Since June, I'm afraid that I lost you. I hate we grew apart and never. 
never said goodbye Maybe we both just needed space Maybe a different time and place What if we could just rewind? I think it's been about six months Did you forget about our plans? To see each other soon Cause I was flying out just to see And white chicken steam. rice, so, uh, steam chicken rice, and it's roasted. So the difference is one is steam and one is roasted. You eat chili sauce, ah? Yeah. I thought you don't like. The bit. Okay, let's eat. Let's eat. I prefer steam chicken rice though. Sway nicer. We should put like something. This is poking away. It's like stuck. It's stuck? Yeah. That's why I saw the auntie cut it. It was very cool. Don't put chili. Yeah. Mmm! Nice. Mm. Okay. I thought then I would say you're not hungry. No, I'm hungry. Yeah. <laughs> you want cucumber? No. Don't give it to me. Like for the price of three fifty, right? Like, it's very worthy. You know, there is no takeaway cost. Yeah. You have. Hmm? You have. Oh, you have. Each of my head. Hmm. Okay, so Asians, right? We really love rice and noodles, but I believe in your country, like, let's say, France, Wales, Scotland, Scotland. Germany, I think you guys don't Europe. really eat rice and noodles, but yeah, rice we have is bread though. Yeah, I mean their croissants are nice. Eh? But if you come to Asian country, you need to eat rice. It's like rice gives rice and noodles give me this satisfaction. Like, mm. Mm. mommy, I thought you are the noodle person. Yeah, rice and noodles. I almost forgot to take dinner. So dinner, the winner is noodle soup. So it's a homemade kind of noodle soup. And our grandma actually cooked us some noodle soup. So it looks like this. So it's a very homey and I would say healthier than eating outside. So you have noodle, you have soup. My grandma placed in meat. So. Uh, it's minced meat, some dried scallops, and there is an egg at the bottom. Can you see? Egg. Oh, this is delicious. I paired it together with a chrysanthemum tea. Alicia paired it with a peach tea. And yeah, I think that's it for this challenge. I hope you guys enjoyed it. I... Are you dying in the toilet? <laughs> Yeah, so thank you for joining this challenge together with us. Maybe I should take a mukbang right now. Okay, let me place my camera. I can barely see you. I'm very far away. Yeah, you're very far away. No, oh, we went further away. Because <laughs> you moved it towards you. No, I didn't. I moved it towards you. Scallop. Dry scallops. Mm. Mm. Can you imagine those people who are in the Eras tour now?
I think this will take forever if I continue filming my mukbang. So, see you in my next video. Thank you for taking part in this challenge. Bye bye. Bye bye.